All right, folks. It is time once again for another Latchkey food review. Uh, sorta. Of. <laughs> Today we're returning to Bojangles to get their steak biscuit. Now I know about a month and a half or something like that ago I done the uh, steak, egg, and cheese biscuit at Bojangles. But sometimes it's about the deal that they are carrying and right now Bojangles is offering two steak biscuits for five dollars. Now you can't get the uh, egg and cheese on there to get it for that price but what you can get you know is uh, a pack of jelly or something like that which uh, jelly goes good on there so uh, hey I figure you know since you know times is tough and times are hard I would let I'd let the world know <laughs> at least my ever-growing subscriber base which I appreciate all the newcomers that are coming in by the way uh, so I want to bring to y'all something you know on the specials as well you know as the new food and uh, reviewing the uh, food that is popular with these restaurants that is already out there been out there for years and stuff like that you know sometimes we may revisit those foods and uh, sometimes you know like today it's just all about what they've got on special you know get it while the getting's good two biscuits for five dollars that is a good deal i've got my own drink with me today so we're going to uh take advantage of the deal we'll see you when we get to bojangles all right folks we are pulling up on the bojangles now and look at there there it is two for five steak biscuits now <laughs> this town right here doesn't have a Hardee's Hardee's has the number one steak biscuit of anybody out there so just to show you there is a line of cars we gotta wait behind they are all coming here for that steak biscuit now if Hardee's was in town this Bojangles wouldn't have this big line because the Hardys that used to be here, <laughs> this is where everybody in the town went was to the Hardys. But since they moved away, and I don't really understand why, because the, they packed the house there in the morning. You couldn't even get in a line. As big as this line is, the line at Hardys back then would have been all the way out to the road. And I just don't get it why they moved away. Well, I do get it because the, the landowner with it was sitting on the Hardys. The lease came up and, uh, and they wanted to build a mini mall there. So apparently the Hardys that was here did not want to pay that uh, lease lot anymore. But they didn't look for anything else in this town and replace Hardys, which was a mistake. We'll get into that in a, on another video for sure. But today it's all about this uh, two for five steak biscuit at Bojangles man I can't believe it and uh Hardy's has the number one steak biscuit but this place has the number two steak biscuit and uh hey that is fine with me because it is also a good biscuit in its own right and uh I am here for it we'll see you when we get through this tough line yeah let me get uh your two for five steak biscuits that be all? yes ma'am all right, thank you. You can't beat that with a stick, folks. $5.50. $5.50 for two biscuits. Now, if that don't fill you up, I don't know what will. Because normally I get this thing in a combo, you know, with the Diet Coke and with the uh, hash browns that bojangles have they call them bow rounds which are very good by the way they're very large circular hash browns you don't get but four of them but they're big and uh, they actually got onion cooked into the hash brown itself which is awesome they're awesome by the way but today it's all about that steak biscuit and uh, I got one car in front of me we should be getting it in a second I'm gonna ask for some of that there grape jelly to put on there with them and uh we'll go doctor them bad boys up 
We'll have us a good breakfast this morning off of them. All right, so they were out of the grape jelly. I guess uh, everyone else had my idea as well. <laughs> uh, they did have others, but, you know, I'm partial to that grape, so. I decided to just go without it, you know, eat the steak biscuit raw. <laughs> I mean, not really. But it's good on its own. It stands alone. I mean, you know, could have got some other condiments, I suppose, like maybe some mustard or some. Oh, so there you go. Good little sized piece of steak. Good sized biscuit. We got another one just like it in the bag. But yeah. There you go. Two for five. <laughs> that is a really good steak biscuit folks It's kind of like a fried cube steak on a biscuit. It is a very popular item here in the South. First one I ever ate was from Hardee's and I think they started it only as far as the fast food chains are concerned they started it and for a long time they had to market cornered on it nobody else had them anybody McDonald's Burger King no nobody had them Now there's some mom and pop chain restaurants that have good steak biscuits that are on par with Hardy's here in the upstate. But as far as the commercialized one goes, Bojangles is the only one that can kind of compete with the Hardy's steak biscuit for sure. Bojangles biscuits are good. They're a different kind of good. They, they are awesome. One down, one to go. Oh, this one. That piece of steak is thicker. <laughs> wow. My lucky day.
I don't know how to get that cube steak so tender in there. And the crust so crusty. But you know what? That would be good. With some gravy as well. They done me right on these folks. These are good. I mean, awesome. Eating this much food for $5.50, I almost feel like I'm stealing it in this crazy economy we deal with. <laughs> Which is a good thing. A good thing. Now, it is a darn shame. I can come here and get two steak biscuits for $5.50, but I can go to Bojangles. My daughter likes that chicken fry combo they got there. It's an eight piece chicken fry combo. With a medium drink, medium fries. Costs $9 and some change. That meal should cost no more than what this one right here costs. All right, folks. It is time to hit the road and talk about it in the afterthoughts. Coming up next. All right, so uh, my final thoughts on the uh, Bojangles two for five steak biscuit deal is <laughs> two thumbs up for sure. Let's just get that out of the way right now. Two very high thumbs up on that. Uh, that is some good food. That is some good food at a low cost. What better way to start your morning? <laughs> One of those is, you know, pretty you know, high in calorie, I think, but yeah, two of them, you know, definitely does the job. And I'll hold you over for a long time throughout the day. Oh, and that is a good thing, you know, when you're starting your morning out, you know. Eat less throughout the day and uh, maybe, you know, eat another decent sized meal and then call it a day. <laughs> but I do like the fact that the, uh, they have those for uh, two for five. I mean, wow. I mean, two dollars $5.50. What else do I need to say? Good tender steak, crispy fried crust on the steak. Biscuits are amazing. Soft, fluffy, hot, beautiful. I just absolutely loved everything about those steak biscuits. Rumbo Jangle. Man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I'm tired of bragging on Bojangles now. <laughs> and that is all I have for this review. Go try them for yourself. All right, folks. Until the next one. Y'all have a good one.